So hey guys, welcome back in Gori Mangla YT and another video. And it is and in this video we'll learn that last of video we, as we learned that every feature that login, sync up, delete, sign out, okay, and everything. So now, as we know that uh, if our already our user is login, so we don't want again that uh, we don't want this pop up display again, okay? We don't want this UI if our user is already logged. So how we can create that system? It's basically very easy. Now let's learn. So first of all, what I do basically just go to player data and blueprints, okay? And now first of all, you need to find that why you saved your UI data. So in my case, that is save it here. So for now, I'm just cut for there because I'll save in my data in my third person player and connect it with your begin play and because we have you have the return value so just unplug this thing promote a variable and set it to ui data and then connect it with this thing and connect it with, add with viewport so basically you find basically your viewport data okay now what will we do that will we get uh, uh current see you current uh, user data so it just should be data uh, if it's not coming like this don't worry just search that author and here you find that get current user data and let's it to is evaluated or is valid so what will be do okay from this ones okay if this is valid so will we get our user data that uh, set visibility okay so let's come add a pin at here so it will be look more nice so what will we do that if it's valid so it should be disable the ui and if it's uh, invalidated so it should be display that ui okay now compile and save so it's uh, in even begin play okay now let's try comp as you can see we are f uh, finding this thing so now let's click on login as so at uh, gmail.com password one two three four five six seven eight let's first of all sing up um done now let's log in okay done now let's come play as you can see we don't find any of basically the as you can see that we don't find any of login uh ui okay or the sing up ui because we are already login okay yeah that is great now we want a one more that if we want to basically you know that we don't want to play more we want to log out or something like that so now let's create something like that too so let's go to ui and let's create another ui that is ui2 so at the ui2 what i add basically i just add my this uh, image okay so that is also pretty much enough a nice image so we we can use this like a basically for our left side pop-up data that are we want to basically we want to log in or just we want to basically find our profile so yeah so let's also come at here so we'll be do the same thing that create a widget and at here because i want one more so what i do from the even begin play we add a sequence okay a cq that is a sequence and then once we found the sequence we can connect it with this thing now let's also click on add to set to this one and then promote a variable let's call this thing that ui data 2 okay that is our basically the ui data 2 so now let's also connect it with this thing with add to viewport but make sure uh, we don't want that is all time visible so say uh, set visibility that is basically because it's first time so first time it should be in hidden okay so now we want that when we press the q keyboard it should be display that one so set it to q that uh, q k e y keyboard so I want that if I press the Q keyboard, it should be display the UI. So we'll be get the U data to then set visibility, set visibility. And now I'll be add a flip and flop. Okay, the flip and flop will be help us. So set that first time visibility visible, second time it should be hidden. So connect it with B and set the target with data two. Okay, so everything is pretty much here at done. So if I click on now play 
as you can see it's not displaying so if i press the q keyboard so it should be coming my left side so in my left side i want that now i can log in and others data okay now let's create that system because as you know that we set up that thing in our ui that is the our uh the delayed uh, data or thing out okay so we'll be just simply grab them both so simply we can cut come in ui data too and we can paste it at here okay so paste so as you can see it should be come yeah it come so you can get this thing and that is basically our delayed data so if you want you can change this size so let's set it to 300 and let's set it to 50 okay now let's set the gravity to left sides okay so we have now the delayed and then let's come at here again and let's also cut this thing come at here and simply paste at here also as you can see that is at come at here so what will we do simply just trade at here and set it to 300 okay and let's set it to size to 50 okay now that is looking same okay i think not same 300 300 300 okay <coughs> <coughs> okay so as you can see it's uh, quite enough good at here so we need to just simply do some adjustment mm, okay i think that is good okay so delete and this hang out okay so now whatever we write it at here that the uh, message and other stuff we can basically do the same thing at here so the delete and sign out okay so if that is sign out is done so we want to pop up display that okay so we'll be open level class by reference if we deleted that also we do the same thing okay so it will be basically simply uh it will be work so what will we do will be get the sound and the delete data and at here what will we do will be first of all search that auto and will be get the current user data and then is evaluated or is valid so for sign out okay so it should be again search that auto or you can just go to your graph and as you can see what we add at here so we can remove for now at here so this thing out so simply cut this thing come at ui2 and paste it at here okay and the for uh, the deleting the user data we can remove this stuff and simply cut this thing because we don't want this data more at here so we want at here so simply connect it with this thing so now if everything is done so we'll be set the open level by reference that is we should be restate or the restart our game or our level okay so but there's a problem it should only uh reopen our level so let's try that uh third person uh, what is our map data we are what is basically our map data let me check map it is a third person first of all let's compile and save so we will be get the all the information so it should become the third person here's the third person map data or if it's sign out also it should be open our level again okay now compile and save now let's compile and save now let's run so as you can see we have the queue data so now let's click on delete out and as you can see uh it's basically sing up and again everything is done okay now let's say sajad so at uh, gmail.com and the pass one two three four five six seven eight now let's first try to log in account login is done because we already execute that one okay but as you can see after the login it's not opening uh, basically uh, the display is not going okay but if you play again it should be go okay now if i press again the queue so basically the delete as i seen that the delete okay the delete also working everything is working but the problem is uh the first of all we need to go to sign up and let's set the gravity to left side and uh, as you can see that if i press the login or the sign up is if i click click on the login it's not uh, disabling this thing so what i can do after that doing this thing what you can basically do open level by reference so it will be basically reset my level again so everything will be come goodly so there's a no error will be come okay but as you can see that our database oh sorry uh our database is now empty so we need to create a use account so 
and let's click play now i uh, if i add sajjad at uh, gmail.com and add the password sorry one two three four five six seven eight and if i click on login there's a should be error come message mm, because this is not evaluated as a double jet it is a chat at uh, gmail.com one two three four five six seven eight now let's click on sing up account create is done and let's click on login and yeah we are login okay we can also add some duration or delay so it will be help us so as you can see if i click on sign out so we can again now do the same process okay so everything is now pretty much enough for working okay so i hope you understand okay so thank you so much for watching guys love you all and bye bye and see you in next video so i think there's a as you can see it's uh, not login yeah it's login so let's add some D E L Y delay uh, two seconds for opening the level on the login okay so on that it's uh, oh sorry not this one it should be <coughs> do in on the login done okay now it should be work let's click on play now let's click on sing out let's add sajjad at uh, gmail.com pass one two three four five six seven eight now let's click on login the login will be done then after two seconds i'll be coming this page okay so i can now delete my data and sing out okay so i hope you understand thank you so much for watching guys love you all bye bye see you in the next video